there's a man from Granard, no one knows his second name. But he's known all over Ireland, and this is very strange. What would we do without him, for our crusty batch or plain? The man that we all know called Pat the Baker. He has forty foots and bridges, and a fleet of fans as well. If you're on the Cork to Longford Road, you'll meet the Jiggerdale. He feeds us all from Donegal, Charlo to Clonmel. The man that we all know called Pat the Baker. When Pat he started baking in 1961, he had no high-tech factory and his fleet just numbered one. He'd bake all night till morning, then he'd load his little van. And whenever it was empty, he'd come home and bake again. He has 40 pots and fridges and a fleet of vans as well. If you're on the Cork to Longford Road, you'll meet the Jiggerdale. He feeds us all from Donegal, Carlo to Clonmel. The man that we all know called Pat the Baker. Safe from little acorns, big oak trees will grow. And Pat, he knew it was true, there was money in the dough. For now he is a wealthy man, although it doesn't show. He's still the same old friendly Pat the Baker. He has forty foots and fridges, and a rake from Barry Klein. He has shop and stars without guitars, and they're all doing fine. They're shaking and they're baking, so you and me can dine. And all the fancy bread from Pat the Baker He has forty pots and fridges And a plate of lambs as well If you're on the cart to Longford Road You'll 